Yo, what is going on people? This is JRP and welcome to my next vid of NBA 2K12 where right here we are playing against the New Jersey Nets and we're trying to wrap this up because this was basically a long ass game and I'm not talking about just by the time reference. I'm talking about based on how we had to hold these guys down, especially me. I had to hold down Darren Williams and that ain't no easy task by any means. And just for the fact that yo, we hit try to beat these guys twice and we actually defeated them twice it's like we just basically got the monkey off our belts so to speak because just by me playing against Darren Williams is just a pain in the ass to deal with but basically you know as I said from like my last video as far as with the NBA you know the tentative lockout you know with the whole tentative thing is over so basically right now guys could get back to doing their stuff just for a little bit and I'm you know training camp and all that stuff I don't know how they're gonna sort that out but um as like I said from my last video you know there were some trades going on but there ain't no trades as far as with these two things in particular with Orlando Magic and the New Jersey Nets where they're trying to give up two first rounders for um you know Dwight Howard and also Brooke Lopez in that whole package deal and also Boston Celtics and um what you call it? the New Orleans Hornets with Chris Paul and Rajon Rondo that trade isn't happening because Chris Paul did not sign the contract extension if he had did that a couple of days ago there would be a trade but there ain't no trade so y'all could breathe a little easier so back to the whole gameplay here right now since I basically have nothing else to talk about on the NBA side as far as of my knowledge other than those two topics that were just big um if we had lost this game, we would have dropped to like the eighth spot, and Charlotte, um, Bobcats would have moved up ahead of us to the seventh. I didn't basically want that, so basically I just basically did everything in my power, along with my teammates, to try and win this game because I already know how this shit is gonna go down. I, I already know it's gonna be a tight race, and I'm trying to win as much games as I can. That's all I'm trying to do for this team. And as far as with the whole moves and thing, I think we're doing pretty good. But there's some work that needs to be done. And, you know, you know what you call it? You got Brandon Roy and obviously what you call Greg Oden. He needs to get more rebounds for us, man. I mean, I can't stress that enough. I mean, three, four rebounds a game. I mean, yo, that's not good enough, yo. And what you call it? You got, um... What you call it? Davis underneath trying to help you out too. I mean, come on. You already know what time it is. You already know, man. Just get the rebounds. Get to work. That's all you got to do. So, this is JRP, man. I'm going to catch you on the next vid. Peace. So, the 76ers win it. Both teams played well, but these guys had the edge. Yeah, I think so. They were just steak knife sharp.